had no idea. <laughs> Everything's magical when it snows. Everything looks pretty. The clothes are great. Coats, scarves, gloves, hats. Do you know that the best things in my life have happened when it snowed? Have yourself a merry little Christmas. exciting is happening right now friends it is snowing okay it is i think seven o'clock right now we haven't had much snow yet this year so i declare today a very festive celebration to honor the snowstorm that is happening outside right now i'm gonna go play in the snow my inner child is just about to burst it's gonna be a magical day i kind of just want to share this magical day with you guys i love making up not like holidays, but reasons to enjoy something that might seem mundane. I know it snows a lot in winter, but I think like the first big snowfall is such a good reason to celebrate. So that is what we're going to do today.
decided to be a bit British today and make mince pies for the first time. I've never made these before. I've never had them before. Obviously, they're not going to be very authentic. I don't even know what type of mince meat I got. I don't know if that was like a good brand or not. And I didn't make the puff pastry either. I just got it from Trader Joe's. So I just kind of threw them together. But I know that these are kind of a staple in England um, during Christmas time. So I wanted to try them. I know that they're supposedly really sweet because when I first thought of a mince pie, I, I wondered if there were meat in them. <laughs> but there's not, at least I don't think there is. I have been educated. I, I am expecting them to be very sweet. That is, that is so good. It was like a Christmas party in my mouth. I added in a bit of extra orange zest and you can really taste it. And it also tastes of cinnamon and cloves and nutmeg. And then there's like, is that like candied fruit or just fruit and like raisins and oh my gosh, this is so good. Mmm. My fellow Americans, do you guys make these? We should be making these. Mmm. I've also got some of my homemade hot chocolate mix, which I personally think beats out all other hot chocolate mixes that I've tried. The plan for today is to wrap presents and maybe go out in the snow a bit again, but there are a bunch of snow clouds coming back in. I think it might even get a bit stormy. So if that's the case, I'll probably just stay in and wrap presents and watch White Christmas. It's such a comfort film for me. And then tonight we have a dinner reservation at our favorite restaurant. We don't go very often because it's a bit pricey, but our anniversary is coming up right after Christmas and we just decided to splurge tonight and go treat ourselves. And then afterwards, our main street is is completely lit up it's really beautiful um, so we're gonna go walk around and see the Christmas lights and then come home and I think we still might have a bit more wrapping to finish up and this might sound just so weird and cringy and absolutely cheesy but when I was younger I always imagined myself older and what it would look like before I had a kids but I was in a relationship or married and I always envisioned turning on a record of maybe Bing Crosby or just like some classic Christmas music and dancing in front of the Christmas tree at like 2 a.m. on Christmas Eve. I don't know why, but I've always just loved the idea of like dancing to the Christmas lights. So I think now I'm going to drink this hot chocolate, turn on White Christmas, and get to wrapping. <laughs> Okay, so it is four o'clock and I wanted to hang out with Jared a bit, but he has some work to finish up. So I'm here at the mall because he encouraged me to come here and get myself a Build-A-Bear because he knows that I've been wanting one. So I thought that I would take you guys along with me. So let's go get my teddy. I'm so excited. Also, if you think teddy bears are just for children um, and not for adults, that is wrong. It's not true. Teddy bears are self-care. Okay, let's go. Mr. Lawrence, but I'm not Miss March, I'm only Joe. And I'm not Mr. Lawrence, I'm only Laurie. 
So kiss me under the mistletoe Pour out the wine, let's toast and pray for December snow Yeah, there's been pain this year, but it's time to let it go Next year you never know Now Merry Christmas, we'll dance in the kitchen while embers glow We've both known love, but this love we've got is the best of all I wish you could see it through my eyes and you would know My God, you would 